he might fit into this defensive line, into this defense in general? What are your thoughts? Yeah, so me, I, I feel like <clears throat> what I was told that I'll be, you know, inside. Um, so inside is going to be my world. Um, you know, three technique to four technique, whatever, what's ever asked me. Um, I know that I'm going to be inside. Um, some downs I may be outside, but I know for the most part I'll be inside, you know, using my quickness and ability against those guards um, and create mismatches in one-on-one -on -one situations. What do you think is the best thing that, uh, you know, your best attribute, like mm -hmm. what is the most important thing you think you could bring to this defense? Um, I feel like versatility um, and depth. Um, the fact that I can play across the line of Across the line of scrimmage, um, it definitely helps. You know, give some of the older guys a break um, that we can rotate. I can fit here or fit here if necessary, or coaches can plug me in here without skipping a beat. Um, so I feel like my versatility. Thanks, Colby. You talked about your quickness. Uh, you're not the biggest guy to play inside. Are you eager to see how that works in the NFL when most of the guys that you're going against are going to be bigger, yeah. and, and how that translates? Yeah. So. Um, I, I know what world I'm, I'm going to be in. Um, you know, playing SEC, uh, it definitely prepares you. Um, it's not the same level, but it definitely prepares you. Um, it's pretty close. Like exactly. Honest, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I feel like I, I played, you know, the last two seasons, so I, I'm not no stranger to it. I know how to, you know, work. I know how to keep my feet on the good base pad level. Um, so it's just about technique. Um, and, and, yeah, I will, I will bulk up, you know, over time, add muscle. Um, but, yeah, I'm just I'm excited to be here. What, what's the concern? Because uh, you, you, you talked about your quickness, your ability to slip around things and move. As you start to get bigger, how do you make sure that you can still move yeah. the same? And, and who have you talked to about that? How do you train to, to make sure you can still do that? Yeah, so just uh, with that, I just got to like not add, add good weight on, not get fat and sloppy, um, add it on the muscles in certain parts, um, and just really be a technician with it. Um, with, with, when I'm playing inside, I have to be more of a technician because I know that's you know that's that's that that world down there. So, um, being I'm gonna have to play behind my pads, have great hands, pad level, um, and, and when the weight does come on, I'm gonna be able to add it all together. So yeah. There's not a lot of experienced guys coming back on this defensive line. So how do you look at the opportunity here for, for some playing time? Yeah, I'm biting at the chomps. Like <laughs> I'm 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 on that bet's hip trying to I'm, I'm trying to play, man. Like. I, I'm trying to learn this defense, man. I, I, I want to play. Like that's the best way to play. I want to play. I want to be on the field. I, I sat the field. I sat the bench one time. My career, hated it. So I vowed I would. Uh -uh, I'm busting my tail to get on that field. Whether I got a special team, D line, uh, I'm just trying to get on that field. I'm hungry. One of those guys next to you on the bench field that day when you sat on the bench. Man, not real happy. sitting next to you. Not real happy. Ooh, used to crack <laughs> jokes. <laughs> yes, sir. Are you looking forward to learning from a guy like Kenny Clark? Oh yes. Oh yeah. Yeah, definitely. Watching his film and watching his like his technique and how good of a technician he is, it like definitely you know inspires you to want to do what he do. Like he's he's all pro for a reason. Like you don't get much closer than that. Like. So, you know, just to learn and take bits and nuggets of, from what he's done. And then, you know, we got Preston Smith. We got plenty of dudes around here that's, you know, been there and done that. So I'm just blessed to come into a situation where I can learn. Like, I want to be a sponge. I want to learn as much as possible. So, you know, that's what I'm, that's what I'm here for. That's what I'm doing. Have you dreamed of getting that first sack in a, in a Packers uniform? Not yet, not yet. I'm right now. I'm just trying to. I'm trying to get the the play calls. You know, I ain't trying to mess up. So, right now, I'm just. I'm just focused on the plays. But I feel like the closer we get, that's when I'm gonna start dreaming about like, oh, it's almost here. Oh shoot! All right. But yeah, uh, right now, I'm just. I'm just focused on getting the plays and you know, handling my business. As you get to know this rookie class, like, what are your thoughts? As, as you get to know the guys and a lot of youth coming in. And this is kind of transforming into the youth movement here in Green Bay. Yeah, yeah. So I, you know, I knew Luke from the combine. I knew Jr. from before. Like a lot of these guys, I've known from before. Um, so you know, it was kind of like just a, a reconnection. Like what's up? You know, that sort of thing. Um, we all grinding, all trying to get it and working. Um, we all got the same goal. We all hungry. That, that's one thing I can say. All of us are hungry uh, to play, get on the field, um, itching to get on the field. So. We all got the same mindset, which definitely helps the cause and definitely helps us, you know, push towards the right goal. Have you ever played in snow before? No. 
like, no. <laughs> so what are your, like, thoughts and expectations for it? Like, are you excited? Are you nervous? Like, I mean. All right, so like, so I was nervous at first, but then somebody said the fields, they be heating the fields before, so that kind of calmed me down. Like, all right, all right. Um, but nah, like, I, I know I'm going to put Vaseline and, and, and Tiger bombed up, so. I'm just excited to get out there, rain, sleet, hail, snow. I, I'm, I don't care. I want to play football. That's what I'm here for, and that's what I love to do. Are you ready for all the cheese-related puns with your name? <laughs> I know you probably got that question a bunch, but Tucker Craft, Kobe Williams, yeah. I mean, it's a cheese theme. Yeah, so I... I'm not gonna cap. I was I was about to be cheesy one time on an Instagram post. I was about to put some cheesy stuff with Coke with my name in it. But no, nah, I'm just it's cool. You know, I don't mind it. I don't mind it because I've been here now all my life. So it's gonna be interesting to see what new jokes people come with. Um, and yeah. So you're all right if we say it's a Kobe Jack, Kobe Sack? Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah, that's smooth. Yeah, 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 I like that. I like that. Yeah, Kobe Jack.